Hi YouTube, this is Rose, and I'm making this video. I didn't want to make this video, but I have to make this video. Now, this is my last video I posted, and it's already got 10 thumbs down. Uh, folks, it's the Word of God, okay? Yes, it's my voice, but if you don't, like me then why do why are you coming to my channel and thumbs giving me a thumbs down on the word and let me just say I've I've had a channel on YouTube I took over my daughter's channel in 2013 and um, I've been through a lot I've had my channel for a very long time up until the time I believed that it was time to shut my channel down because I was listening to Donna now, I don't, um, I'm not putting any blame. I take full responsibility. I made the decision to shut my channel. I reopened it back up. Actually, that was Donna and my daughter Ashley's idea. It got opened up again, so I figured I'd start posting videos again as well. And now, I have been on um, Servants of God's uh, channel. Or, or, uh, you know, I've been a subscriber. And I uh, stood with her, as she would like, she liked to put it, or like Donna likes to put it. And um, uh, I thought she was uh, not only a leader and a teacher of of what we call uh, the church on her channel, but a friend. And um, I also believed she was a belie she's a believer. And, and that she was somewhat honest with me. That she was honest with me. Not somewhat, but honest with me. Now, when this situation between Donna, Sister Robin, and Apostle Laura Lee happened, that had nothing to do with me. But I was stuck in the middle of it. The first video uh, Apostle Laura put, and the other few other videos she put, um, I was heartbroken. And I told her that I was, you know, going to have to step away. And I told Donna that I was going to uh, end my ministry with her because she doesn't want to have anything to do with her or anybody. She didn't want to have anything to do with anyone who has anything to do with Donna or Robin. So, uh, what happened was I emailed, I wanted to email the last portion of that to show Donna that I was done with her ministry. I decided to stay and stand with Donna, but I did not know. I made a huge mistake and I emailed the whole conversation. So now Sister Laura thinks I betrayed her uh, privacy, which I didn't. It was a mistake. And uh, Donna uh wouldn't even before that she wouldn't um answer my calls even though i was crying and very upset but for three days she posted videos on her channel about uh you know a tree is known by its fruits and that uh, lamb at the gate and it turned into a wolf and uh by the third day, something like that, uh, her and, and Sister Robin were like, yeah, if it doesn't hew fruit after three years, hew it out. Or if it doesn't give good fruit, hew it out by the root. Amen, Sister Robin, or whatever. I have a short video. I recorded it. Just, I, you know, I, I thought it was really mean. And then she posts a comment on my channel saying, we know how you feel about us, and we were wondering why you would have our video on your channel. Well, uh, throughout the whole thing, I'm sick, right? And I didn't get to be able to, you know, put on private or uh, get rid of all these videos on time. Meanwhile, Sister Laura starts going into saying that she is, uh, she starts going from Robin's teachings to Donna's teachings to Donna being a man. Okay, and the, the whole time I'm thinking at first, 
that I hurt my best friend, and not only just my best friend, but God's servant, because I truly believed she was hearing from God. The Holy Spirit of God? Okay, so I was crushed. And and I could not forgive myself there for a second. It it threw me back big time. And uh, you know, all the things that Sister Laura was saying, I'm sorry, but they made sense about the Melchizedek, about the uh, uh, seeing through a glass darkly, and some of the you know that that one teaching about Robin, you know, and all I said in the email was, I don't know about Robin. She doesn't have anything I want, which means it's an expression. Who do you listen to? You listen to people that have what you want. When I say somebody doesn't have what I want, it doesn't mean they ain't got nothing for me. That means I don't study them. And I explain that up and down three different, I don't know how, not three, I don't know how many different ways I explained it in messages, you know, uh, on uh, phone messages, uh, private messages to Donna. No reply, no reply, just a bunch of videos and very not cool, not cool. But I could understand. I was like, I wasn't blaming them. I'm saying not cool now. Okay, so then me and Sister Laura were cool, right? And I made a video saying that I think her work is impeccable. Okay, I've appreciated her work. She let me, uh, she had me join her ministry. She added me to her ministry. And it was a blessing. I was doing prayer rounds. I don't know if anybody's, you know, I know everybody that loves Donna thinks that, she, you know, I don't know what, I, I can only guess what you guys think of Laura. But if you would have read any of her work, it's, uh, I appreciated it. Okay. I accepted her as an apostle. No big, huge deal. If you understand what apostles are. So, or apostolic, you know, somebody who's an apostle raising up a church of apostles, raising disciples into an apostolic level. It's no big deal. It's what we're supposed to be doing. I believe I want to be on fire. I want to be filled with oil. I, I'm not seeing where this is a bad deal here or where I'm trying to be bad. Anyways. Okay. So, um, just so everybody knows. I am not trying to ring L Laura Lee's bell. I, I'm just going to explain everything, and it'll all fall into place after I'm done. Okay, so back to uh, Robin and Donna. In this meantime, well, I'm crushed. My heart is broken. I feel horrible, and uh, I'm trying to contact her. No, no reply. And uh, she gave me one reply before... Uh, I get I sent the email on accident and it was on her channel. I told her I would still stand I'm standing with you. You know, and she replied a nice reply. But after that, but she didn't reply to my messages. She didn't reply to my tears or my broken heart, right? So anyways, um in the meantime, while all she's making all these videos her and sister Robin, she's mentioned in that pocket of time, I talked to Robin 24-7. I talked to Robin 24-7. I talked to Robin 24-7. She repeated it uh, f at least twice on one of the videos. And, and I almost saw, I believe she said it on all the videos, three the three videos in a row. So, in the meantime, and so she can't call me, though. She can't return my call. Now, time goes, uh, uh, as as everything started to unfold, Sister Ra uh, Sister Laura, me and her were cool, but I sent her a, a last email after we said our goodbyes. My mistake, but she had been posting videos and she had been praying for everybody. And I said, I'm grateful for your prayers. You know, it's it's working. It, you know that that uh, spell is is coming loose or something like that. I was being kind, and she put out a video. Oh, and I, I mentioned something else I'll keep between me and Sister Laura, but maybe that was it. 
she got all upset and said don't throw donna in my face and uh i've never thrown donna in your face laura never once when i made that reply it was i saying thank you for your prayers now you make a video saying i'm lost are you th if i'm gonna listen to a woman in a wig uh you don't even know if i'm saved you know that's one of the meanest things you could say to a to a person that loves Christ. Matthew 16, 23, But he turned and said unto Peter, Get behind me, Satan. Thou art an offense unto me, for thou savorest not the things that be of God, but those things that be of men. Now we remember these scriptures, right, folks? Did he tell Peter, Don't ever talk to me again. Get out of my church. You, you're not going to be in this church, and I don't want to have nothing to do with you, and la la la. No, he did not. He was raising up a church. He was laying a foundation, raising up apostles. Okay, so um, as far as I'm concerned, I, I'm not, I don't recommend anybody follow either one. But everybody makes their own decision. That's cool. I just want to let everyone know that loves Donna. I've never gotten all these thumbs downs. I got 40 at one point. I've never in all these years. And I've had some serious hardships and people sending me things that are just unspeakable in, in emails. I won't even tell you the pictures that people have sent me. Of, of of children and just horrid but I stuck with it because I love everybody and I I mostly I love God and I want to do God's work but when I first started doing this I I did it out of love for the truth and I always thought that I was helping or uh, posting videos for someone else's channel because I appreciated their work and I believed in them and now, because I've decided that I don't want to listen to Donna, which, and the, la the last thing I have to say about this whole thing is those that do love Donna, those that are hating on me because I don't follow her no more, just remember this. You have been following a person who has claimed to be a teacher, a a love to preach, and hearing from God, but it's, a, it's not an open-door church. It's an open and closed window church. Sometimes the window's open, sometimes it's closed. Sometimes it's open, sometimes it's closed. You know, I pray that everybody's uh, loyalty lie with Jesus Christ. And if you truly love Jesus, why would you be knocking down my channel? What have I ever done to anybody besides try to be and do my best out of love so that's it um, you know if anybody wants to continue to um, give me thumbs down well thanks for the views and for everybody else God bless everyone and for those that um, do listen to my channel and uh, share their precious time with me I appreciate it more than you know, because I know how precious time is. Okay, folks, bye. Okay, so, uh, P.S., I forgot one of the most important things. Uh, one of the main reasons I'm making this video is uh, why I don't listen to Donna anymore. Um, she called. Uh, 10 days later and uh, the reason she called is uh, we've been giving her money whatever we can at the end of the month she never asked I asked to give it to her but we would send her money at the end of the month and um, so that's when she called which was about 10 days later and she spoke 
to Ashley. And after she talked to Ashley, Ashley told me what she said, and she completely flat out lied to Ashley. She knew what was going on between me, her, and Robin. She knows what was going on with Sister Laura because Laura told me that Donna told her she sent her the I sent her the the email. So I don't trust people that lie to me and lie to my children. I'm not here lying to you folks. I am who I am. If you came to my house, you'd get the same person you get on YouTube. I, I do not stop talking about Jesus everywhere I go. Um, I do that because of all the amazing things, wonders and miracles he's done in my life. And I was born a believer. I'm going to start doing uh, testimony. Um, you know, what Laura said and what Laura did about, said about me and, what, and the video she did about me, she was wrong. That's, that's just it. That woman's not perfect. There ain't not a single one of us perfect. She might be, she might have the eyes, intelligent and interesting, but she is nowhere near perfect. And I recommend a liver cleanse and a kidney cleanse because when our livers and our, our livers are clogged, we get very irritable. When our kidneys are clogged, we get very emotional. So, um, that's my recommendation. Uh, and Let's see. Uh, oh, yes. In one of her videos, she was talking about, oh, the birds, the birds. They love to talk about the birds. But when I spoke to her on the phone, she gave me testimony of this bird that had flown right next to her car. It was a white dove, she said, flying right next to her car. This was months prior. She was talking to me about a bird. She was saying that she believed the Spirit of God moved in that animal. I believe the Spirit of God moves in animals. It, the Spirit of God is in everything alive. Mostly the animals. I mean, more us, of course. But, you know, we are his vessels. We are his children. But those things he created, he created to bless us. I don't worship them. You know, she even had Brother Frank with her as a witness, I believe. So, you know, we were all in one accord. And all of a sudden, everything flipped in one second. She said that she never went. She went to Donna's and listened to a few of her videos. She commented on Donna's videos. I don't think Donna ever commented back. But uh, she, you know, stopped listening. And one time I sent her a video like about six, seven, eight months ago. And she said she was blessed by it. You know. But anyways, there was something coming up. I knew it was. I knew this was about to happen. Because, um, well, that's a whole nother story. Uh, you know, she didn't have hardly no uh, people watching her channel when I first started with her. But she did her trans investigation. Now she's got all kinds of people over there. She's talking to me about soul ties. And she's making a video saying, leave my friends alone. So, whatever. <laughs> you know what? Be careful who you listen to. Because what I have found is that God has equipped us with every single thing we need to walk through that door as the Church of Philadelphia. Seek, search, knock, and you will and the door will be open to you and never quit. So, um I think that's it. I made some notes. Um Oh, yes, I was going to read Matthew 7.21. I'll put it on the screen. And uh, also, I uh, just want to let everybody know I'll be making some uh, testimony videos soon so you can all get to know me a little bit better. And um, then uh, for all those that are still th going to thumbs down me and are hating on my channel, I'm praying for you. God bless you. And uh, those that are still with me, thank you so much. You're so precious to me. I love you so dearly. Uh, and, um, you know, I say that from the deepest, you know, part of, of my heart. I, I just love the, the light 
and the glory of god that shines in my brothers and sisters i pray that each and every one of you are as blessed as i am because the lord has blessed me so much my children are doing amazing and i my life is you know um better than it's ever been i can say that in my whole entire life so i am grateful and i pray that um uh, you are grateful and blessed this day also. Thank you so much for your time. And this is for those that were giving me thumbs down. Bye.